Bible saying, therefore, is that the followers must begin to think. Think, think. You need, we need it. We need to find. You need to find strength in yourself. You need to get up. What is it? What has been instilled in yourself? What have you desired of yourself to become in life before somebody else comes and aids you into doing? AIDS, by the way. They said AIDS. Not it's, AIDS. Uh, well, they are uh, very close. Two sides of a coin. Right. Uh, <laughs> Toss it. No, but not, not, <laughs> not HIV AIDS. Oh, uh, don't go there. Now, who told you to go there? <laughs> it's, uh, it's a delicate matter. <laughs> yes. Um, <laughs> let's move forward. We are forwarding forever and ever. We're now, forgetting. Let's leave motivation. <laughs> right. Who has been your greatest supporter mm. in this our environment or outside of this environment? Do you want me to use the word everyone and no one at the same time? Is that a question? Be your greatest supporter first before you get anybody else to support you. Does that make sense? Supporter, Jesus is my supporter. Supporter, Jesus is my supporter. After that, then support. You see, when you sing your song, I am not afraid, <laughs> then you are your own. I like that. You don't try to do what you know somebody else will not do for you. Mm. Don't try it. Mm. You know mm. nobody will do it. Mm. So just do it your there. Stand and wait and see. It is necessary to stand. It's in, it is in, it's in, it's imperative for you to stand and remain standing even when it is bad. Mm. That is why we now come to the question of how easy people yield, you know, to difficulties. Just want to get away from there, you know. So how did you, how did you face all those challenging periods in your life? How did you overcome, you know? Those... I just sang it to you now. No, but that's not, that's that's the it was that's the easy front now. It, no. You mean you just wake up in the morning? Oh, I, I am my greatest supporter. Uh, Jesus is my. Is that what the man is going to be saying to get the food into his stomach? Trust me, darling. You don't know how it comes. Hmm, darling. Trust hmm. me. Nika. It comes. How it comes, you cannot explain it. I cannot begin to give you picture of how a person live day to day. It is not by. It is not by your own making. You, you can shut morning we can shut down everything you can shut down the warehouses can somebody somewhere who sent him did you send him hmm. did you call for him hmm. when you call for help nobody will be there even my best friend has told me my friend will tell me straight think i can't be your cash cash your cash check out. i cannot be your friend i cannot be giving you money i cannot be giving you your i cannot be your checkbook friend that's your friend so if your friend can tell you that and you have to sit down and like, what am I going to do? do? And you can't prostitute, by the way, because our job is prostitution already, don't forget. <laughs> we do one show today, we do another out tomorrow. It's prostitution. Sorry to use that word, sorry, friends. But, but our job is prostitution. We sing to everybody and everybody. we don't know anybody now. We just sing. So, don't, no, wait. No, but sorry. seriously. Sorry, I used to work prostitution. No, no, no. Let, let's, let's, no, I mean, that is uh, it, it, as a joke. But let's be serious It's a serious now. joke. No, but let's be serious now. So, the, the flirtatious uh, attitude, is, is, that, is, that, is, that, is, is that part of art? Well, you know, it's an everyday living, really. It's, it's all just imitation. Hmm. The sad part of it is when we now bring it into the workplace. You see, because obviously you can play the part of a flirt, you can play the part of a prostitute, you can, but that's not a problem. Once you have played your part, that part is gone. You, you get paid. Part. You, you, you get paid for that. But then when you have, now comes to become Part how you're going to get the next job i would then forget it you have actually prostituted for a living simple pure and simple there's no english that can cover or, or sugarcoat that thing you have actually become a a very professional madam let alone there's, there's no okay but, but there's no two ways about no, it no but now let's 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 don't let's be too moralistic are, are you saying that you cannot use your what Your to advantage. get to get what you need? Yes, it's not a bad idea, but don't get offended when people start seeing you as one of those. Uh, serious. Come on, it's not moralistic. It's just pure and simple. You have sold out. Period. And we are plenty. 
<laughs> we are plenty, no, don't worry. No, no, wait. Um, how would I describe you, really? Um, I said in the introduction that you're a humanist, but are you more of a feminist than a humanist? I'm Nigerian. Yes, we know I am that. Nigerian. Now. We know that. Humanist is part of Nigeria. Feminist, it must be part of Nigeria somewhere. But we are still Nigerian, so. But some people are saying that Nigeria will no longer survive. So what are you going to be called? Why? Then? Yeah, because it's, look at just look Why? at all the, uh, uh, the the crystal balls and they're saying Why? all the indicators are just against the fact that you know, I know Chimamanda came on this show and I said How that she? she's beautiful. That the last time she recalled how Nigeria came to be, that it was not made to succeed. Ah, well, you see, we are all entitled to our own opinions. Yeah. We are all entitled to our feelings and our desires. And because I don't like this one or I don't like that one, does not mean to say that Nigeria is still not Nigeria. It's still Nigeria. For now, whoa, it's still Nigeria. I am Nigerian, period. And as far as I'm concerned, whether you are a northerner or a southerner, as long as your face still tell me, when you tell me your pali is still green, you are still Nigerian. I am sorry, I have no discussion <laughs> over that matter. This country, as far as I'm concerned, I'm still in it. It's still looking good to me. I apologize and my prayers go out to the people who have lost so hmm. many lives in their homes. This will stop. I need you to be sure. I need you to focus on that. No matter how many, I have, I, my heart go out to all of you. It goes out to every one of you who have lost souls and lives and properties and unimaginable cries, even their children. But today, I tell you, it will stop. That's what I would tell you. I can tell you, I, I cannot, I can even guarantee that it must stop and it will. That's very passionate. Yes. Now, I, I'm very. I'm also Sorry, my darling. I, I'm, also very, nah. I'm also very inspiring. I, I know you are a very creative person. Maybe just to uh, to uh, put this on the street. Maybe do you also a dirge, or something original. You know, something from mm. your mind. You know, for these families, you know, who have lost uh, loved ones in the last couple of days or hours or minutes or whatever. Something original from you. Just a dirge. Maybe a word or two or you know, two poetic lines or three it's, lines it's, it's, or a song if you like. Because I know your voice can carry all the way across from the studio. To, uh, I, w I, w I wanted to I, I wanted to tell you about a particular gentleman who lost about seven or eight of his children right. and um, the only thing he could think about was to sing and that's the best song I, I've been thinking when you were talking to me it was just that was the best thing he says he, he said it is well hmm. I'm telling you people no matter how many daggers fly it is well. No matter how many oppressions there are, right now, it is well with my soul was the song that came out of that man. The first word that came out of that man's mouth when he lost all his children was, it is well, it is well with my soul. And I sat down. Bros, it's not about who is fighting you at all. It is you and your reaction and your that. response to that attack. It is not about who hates you or who has actually burnt down your warehouses. It is, the, it is not about whether the people that are ruling are clueless or not. Mm. It is how you now respond. It's not how, it is your own reaction to a lot of nonsense going on, even in front of your house, when they point at your <laughs> wives or you point at your children, yes. And your reaction to it, if you go negative, well, mm. whatever happens, don't be offended because you, act, you attacked it. But when you react to it in this manner, it is well with my soul. What comes after? Let us wait and see. All right. What comes after?